Hey everybody, and welcome to, well, a talk about something that Nintendo could do that might make me interested in me getting, getting the expansion pass. And what I'm hoping we'll get. So, I've talked in the past about Mario 3D All-Stars, and it's a great game. However... There's one game on that collection that you think Nintendo Switch couldn't handle. And that is Super Mario Sunshine. Now, Super Mario Sunshine is a GameCube game. And Super Mario, with it being a GameCube game, you know, we, you, couldn't ha handle it. Um, but we, you had to play it. On the game, on with the GameCube uh, stuff. So, what I think should happen is Nintendo needs to bring out GameCube games. That would make the expansion pass somewhat. Understandable to be fifty dollars. Right now, we only have N sixty four, Sega Genesis, and Game Boy Advance. That's not enough, Nintendo. That is not enough. If if you had GameCube, heck, I'd even take Wii games on the Switch. Again, the same thing. Super Mario Galaxy is a Wii game, and it's on a it's on a disc. So, what stopped Nintendo from bringing GameCube Wii games? If they bring those games into the into the front, into the, no expansion pass, I'd say it's worth the money. This whole Splatoon 2, um, Mario Kart 8, Happy Home Paradise, you can buy all three of those cheaper than you can buy a $50 expensive pass. Nintendo, hear me out. Big GameCube and Wii games on the Switch. If you guys do that, then I think it's perfectly fine to charge $50. Look at PlayStation. They charge at least $50. And what do you get? You get free games every month for their service. And that's, yeah, that's great. And you don't have to pay that much. To do that, you can still pay three months, uh, three, and you don't have, and you don't have to pay extra to play the games. You just have to pay extra if you want the whole year. That, right there, is the reason why I think PlayStation knows what they're doing. But, again, the devil will hear me out. GameCube, Wii Games. Maybe add something else. Maybe Sega G CD. Maybe Sega, Gen Sega Game Gear games. I'd be okay with that. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed my little talk about what they could do with the expansion pass to make it fifty dollars. But right now, I don't still don't think that paying fifty dollars is what is worth buying paying that much for three consoles that you can. We could get 
on the Wii U for cheaper. And I know, Nintendo's setting the service down. But again, it's cheaper. I still say that, like I said, I still say Nintendo really needs to either drop the price or add other stuff to the service. Like I was subscribed to the Alice and Guys video.